You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I am back. Rodriance for Black and White Sports. Well, everybody's favorite Insta Thug NBA player. He moonlights as an NBA player. John Moran is back, and that's right. We all can't forget his Instagram live with his gun from the strip club. Well, now photos have emerged from his his night at the strip club. That should be called a, that should, National Lampoon's Night at the Strip Club. And the strip club, it looks like, was called Shotgun Willies. Wasn't that a country singer back in the day? Am I going nuts? Or was that? That was Boxcar Willie. My bad. It was something Willie. Boxcar Willie, Willie Nelson. Oh, my goodness. All right. Yeah. He he decided to uh, spend $50,000 that night. Of course. Got him suspended from the NBA. Oh, man. Uh, feuding with Shannon Sharp. John Morant's a busy dude. Outkick. John Morant reportedly blew 50,000 big ones at a now very public trip to the Colorado Strip Club last week, and a couple of whistleblowers have released the photos, and there's something. Who is this? Zach Dean at OutKick. Photos obtained by the New York Post show Morant getting his money's worth during a lap dance at Shotgun Willie's last weekend where he shelled out at least $50,000 in tips in a two-night bender. Quote, the whole room is full of money. It's literally a pile, one witness told the Post. You'd need a rake. That took me forever to count. One dancer allegedly recalled her colleague saying, look at, look at this. That's all money, folks. Must be the money. There we are right there. There's Ja over there. There's a young lap dance going down. Yep. Here we go. Still covered in money. Look at the food. Bruh, you're eating at the strip club? <laughs> oh, it makes me think about this movie called The Goods where they're eating at breakfast at a strip club. Ah, oh, my God. There we are right there. The thong. What's this guy doing right here? That's what I want to know. This guy is in that picture and that picture. What is his story? Sitting there getting his perv on. Watching John Morant uh, dancing with... uh, (laughs) There's the food once again at the strip club. Oh, man. Details emerge from John Morant's strip club incident... Wow. The club insider told the Post that Morant arrived at Shotgun Willie's with a friend and two security guards around 1.30 in the a.m., just hours after the Grizzlies beat the Rockets in Houston. He apparently snuck in through the back and dropped 900 bones to reserve a VIP room for three hours. The Memphis Grizzlies star then paid four dancers and bottle service and also helped himself to a nice spread of food, including wings, chicken strips, and a nice steak. Wow, these must be different kind of strip clubs. As the above pictures show, Morant then sat back and took in the views, of which there was very little left to the imagination. Quote, he was there to party. He wanted some girls in the room, the insider told the Post. The music was very, very... They use the very uh, offensive ER version of Gangster. So let me, clean, cl- let me clean this up for you. The music was very, very gangsta. There we go. Not to offend anybody. Uh, that hard ER, I know, triggers a lot of people. And that was all on night one. Two days later, Morant returned to Shotgun Willie's and partied again. This time, the NBA star decided to whip out the IG Live and stream himself with a handgun, which led to all hell breaking loose. There he is with said gat, posing with it, smiling. Yep. 
posing and smiling with it. The video went viral last Saturday morning, and the NBA quickly launched an investigation while the Grizzly announced Morant wouldn't play the next two games. Deborah Donifon, the majority owner of Shotgun Willies, confirmed to the Post that Morant was a repeat customer on March 2nd and 4. Quote, this kid, real young, was exceptionally respectful and sweet, and he did not drink on his second visit. Oh, good, he flashed a gun completely sober. We've had the Nuggets and Broncos come in and pitch quarters at the girls, be very disrespectful and nasty. Oh, Morant, he's marvelous. One dancer, however, said Morant's gun, quote, absolutely terrified the dancers in the back room. Quote, he pulled the white boy excuse card. I'm just going through a lot right now. So I'm going to act like a fool and put other lives at risk, she said. Local police investigated Morant for the incident, but determined there was not enough evidence to charge him with a crime. While the police investigation concluded, the NBA's internal investigation is still ongoing. Spokesperson Mike Bass told The Post on Saturday. My, my. It seems that John Morant likes to party down. He likes to party down at Shotgun Willie's. I swear. Look, I'm in Texas. Where I come from, if a place is called something like Shotgun Willie's, it's going to be a honky-tonk. I mean, it's it's going to be a honky-tonk, okay? There's going to be tall-ass trucks, and there's going to be chicks in really tight jeans walking in, and there's going to be some imitation country bands singing your favorite country songs on the inside. If you're lucky, it's mainly uh, Willie and Chris and Johnny and, and well... Anybody else that's not some of this new country music. John Morant, the neighborhood gangsta of the NBA, it seems, and all of his uh, photos have made it out there. I still don't understand the guy, the... Let's go back to it. Let's just... Let's pay particular attention. Let's go back to... Because I just want to put this on extra black. Who is this guy? Who is that guy? I've got the New York Post one up, too. Let me see. Right there. I mean, who is that guy? Why is why is this one white dude, I think it's a white dude, just sitting there staring at the lap dance that's going down? Now, I think this is another dancer back here, but I'm not entirely certain. I'm not. Wow. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. John Morant, yeah. He's uh he's getting down. Oh, there's a picture of him right there. I don't know what that's from. Um, is this from the same night? No, I don't think so. Okay. There he is with his gun. Yes. Okay. Great. Uh John Morant, uh complete with creepy white guy watching the actual dance at the strip club that's look that's about the best analysis you're gonna get of me breaking down some nba trash bag that pulled a gun at the strip club and us breaking down the photos of it shotgun willies pulled a gun creepy white guy watching a lap dance money all over the room Guys, y'all aren't Scarface. I'm just saying. Peace. I'm out. Till next time. Black and White Network supporters, make sure you go over and check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. 25% off USA First. 25% off USA First. Go now. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.